guys. 42 subscribers. <laughs> That's unreal. Yay. The new mailbags have arrived. Aren't they just special? <laughs> Wowie. Mm. That's good coffee. <laughs> Today is Thursday. Doing um, orders that were unfulfilled yesterday. Um, I'm about to go and send them off in the post office. Today is really going to be about things that have been on my to-do list for such a long time. I need to do some stickers that I need to fulfill um, and restock and I've also got five or six different ones that I need to actually make. So I'll film a little bit of doing that. I do actually want to do a video on how I make stickers so I won't be giving too much away. It will be coming in the future though so okay so let's do it let's start the day I've got four or five to do but I'm gonna print one of each and then I'm not gonna put them all up on Etsy I like to just sort of put one set up and then leave it for a couple of days and then put another set up so I'm kind of like one step ahead and then if I have time I, I might go I might go to Hobbycraft oh I don't know oh let's see what happens okay bye
today. Um, I've done stickers, I've photographed my cards, I've made some cards, and I've done my orders. So that's it for me for this vlog. Unless I do end up going to Hobbycraft. I don't want to, but I went to Hobbycraft. <laughs> Oh, we all knew I was gonna do it. I got the most exciting, possibly the most exciting thing I've ever bought ever since I bought my Cricut. Come on, let's have a look. Oh my God, what have I done? So that's it. That's what I got. <laughs> I feel guilty, but it's insane to feel guilty because it's, profit that I have from the business that I'm just putting back into the business. I'm excited to see what I can make on it. Um, I want to do tote bags, t-shirts, um, some really cute tattoo style banners so it's going to feel like Christmas. So I'm not going to unbox it today, I will unbox it tomorrow and yeah then we can have a play and at least I can film everything while I'm doing it. This is genuinely the end of the vlog now. <laughs> Um, thank you so much if you got this far, um, thank you so much for being patient with me making my first video for YouTube. I feel like starting is the hardest part and you know I've, I've been toying with doing this for a year now so I'm glad that at least I have this video up if you're watching this and hopefully we can keep doing them. So I'm going to shut up, make some tea, thank you so much and I will see you next time. Okay, is this like too much? Is it okay? <laughs> there we go. Is that better? Welcome back to another vlog. I bought a heat press. I already have a Cricut Explore Air 2. I use it to make my stickers and I also use it to make cards and it is amazing. I bought myself a Cricut Air 2 about a week ago and I've kept it in the box because I kept saying it will make a good unboxing video because I've always wanted to do an unboxing video and it's honestly been sat in my living room just teasing me. So. We're going to open it today. <laughs> so I bought this Cricut heat press from Hobbycraft. I have a Hobbycraft around the corner from my house. It's very dangerous. I got an email yesterday from Hobbycraft saying that I was a star spender. <laughs> I should mention as well, the reason I bought a heat press is I want to take my Etsy beers to the next level. I want to start producing tote bags and fabric tattoo banners, t-shirts, makeup bags, etc, etc. I'm so excited! <laughs> Honestly, it's been sat here for a week. Even my partner Josh was like, how are you leaving it this long? I was like, for YouTube, baby. Move on. Yay! <laughs> this easy press is in the raspberry colour and it's 9 by 9 It was £170, which I think is okay. Let's do this. <gasps> okay, so we've got... It's in like a little pull string bag. And we've got a little tray. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, so what I'll do is, is I will set it up. Um, I have some designs that I've already made because I was so excited. So what I'll do is I'll show you how I make the vinyl. Then we can go through how I'm going to cut it out on the Cricut machine. And then we're going to test it out. When I was in Hobbycraft buying the Cricut heat press, I also bought some bits um, to practice on. So this is just a cotton tattoo style hanging banner. So I got a few of those to practice with. I also bought some big tote bags. 
Um, these ones are quite heavy duty as well. And I also bought these cotton shopping bags as well, but these will be a lot smaller. So to actually get my designs onto my tote bags, the material I'm using is the Iron On Gloss Vinyl. It's just the Hobbycraft own brand, and there's three meters in this roll, which is pretty good. I don't know if that's because I'm extremely weak, but it's, it's quite hefty, I must say. Okay, so my Cricut heat press has been set up. I haven't plugged it in though because I don't want it to start getting hot. So I'm gonna show you how I make my designs and then let's give it a go. So I'm going to cut out some vinyl and then I'm gonna stick it to my Cricut mat and then we're gonna cut it out. I'm about to have this non-alcoholic beer and I'm watching The Holiday, which is a Christmas film. It's July and I don't give a shit, mate. So this is the outcome. I'm really impressed with how quick and easy it was. It was a bit fiddly getting out all the negative bits of the vinyl, but other than that, I am so excited. So I'm about to make 20 of these. Um, I'm gonna carry on watching the holiday and that's my day. Oh, I'm so excited to see what I make with this heat press. So I hope you enjoyed my unboxing and experiment heat press video thanks again for watching and i'll see you again soon bye <laughs> thanks again for watching and i'll see you again soon bye <laughs> love you